Hi guys, it's Annie from the Postpartum Closet and today I wanted to review for you the Dagny Dover Large Vita Tote in the color Pinto. Uh, this is a 100% organic cotton bag and it's very much a tote. Um, it's like a stiff canvas that somehow still has structure. It's a pretty big variation from what I usually get uh, from the brand but uh, because things still haven't fully opened up, we're kind of doing things that are outside of our normal routine. So we're actually going to parks and having picnics and that sort of stuff just to have some uh, outdoor time while still being socially distant. So <clears throat> I picked this bag up for that exact purpose and it has actually been really good. Um, so this bag has a ton of pockets. You can see a few here. It goes all the way around the bag. Um, and it's really much bigger than I thought it would be. So this is the large, and let me show you in comparison in the event that you have um, an Allen tote. Um, don't know if you could see that. This is the large Allen tote in Sienna, and I've done a review for that. If you're interested, you can uh, check out the link above. And I don't know if the camera's picking this up, but this the Vita tote is significantly larger than the Allen tote. I actually thought they would be comparable in size, but this is probably a few inches taller, um, deeper. It's, it's quite a big bag and I actually don't mind that because this is not something that I'm going to be using as an everyday handbag. I do actually like having the extra capacity because that way I can just take whatever it is that I might need. Um, so let me start going through the bag as I typically do. Um, I'm actually going to unpack what I've gotten here so you can see just how it packs up and what fits and maybe it'll help you decide whether uh, this is a good bag for you. So on the front, um, actually let me point this out first. So you'll see this has two short handles at the top, grab handles, and that is great if you've got it on a car seat or if you're picking it up from the ground. Um, they're nice, short, sturdy handles, but those fall inside the bag and there are also longer shoulder tote handles, which I actually really like. Um, I, I wasn't sure if it would look weird with the extra set of handles, but they just fall in the bag and you don't even notice them when you're carrying them on your shoulder. Carrying the bag, sorry, on your shoulder. So that's the first thing. Um, and again, as I mentioned, these are all uh, a cotton canvas type material. So two big pockets on the front. And uh, in this first one, I've just got some uh, antibacterial disinfecting wipes for surfaces and wet ones for hands. Shove those back in there. Uh, in this one, I've actually got the uh, Sky Essential pouch from the brand. This is in the Pinto as well from Dagny Dover. This is the new seasonal color for spring, summer 21. Um, and here actually you can see the difference between the uh, neoprene and the cotton. Color is pretty similar, but of course the sheen looks a little different on the neoprene. And in here I've just got uh, a few personal items, some makeup items, uh, battery pack. Um, I've shown this one before, it's got the cables built in so I don't need to carry separate cables. Um, I've also just got like some small uh, personal, light, personal care and first aid items for myself. Um, my daughter's stuff I carry separately. So that's just all in there neatly tucked away in the front pocket. Um, excuse me. The other thing I've got, actually no, I've got nothing else in there. So let me turn this guy around. And in this back pocket, I've got a 14 ounce Takea water bottle for my daughter. And that fits in there. Just do that. Um, and here I've got, this is a monkey mat. I'm not sure if you've ever heard of this before, but it's basically um, just tucked in here. It's like a thin nylon. I don't want to open it up because it won't fit on the screen, but it's basically just a, a thin nylon piece of material that opens up. This one opens up to five feet by eight feet and you just kind of lay it on the ground so you don't have to carry a big bulky blanket with you. And this one is, as you can see, pretty small, pretty light. I can link that in case anybody's interested. Um, that's it for these two pockets. This is their uh, cell phone pocket, but because I usually just throw my cell phone in my pocket, I have sunglasses for myself and my daughter in here. And they fit pretty well with room to spare. 
So that's in there. And then here is kind of a bird's eye look at the inside of this bag. You'll see there's still a ton of room in there. And so I will go ahead and start unpacking it. So what I've got here is my 24 ounce Owala water bottle. And this is um, hands down actually my favorite water bottle currently. It's uh, got both a, a straw built in and uh, let me see if I can open it. And uh, you can tip it up for water if you'd like, but there's a, a straw in there as well. Um, <clears throat> That fits right in here. This is a neoprene, let's see, a removable neoprene cup holder. And this is also in the Allen and some of their other totes, but it's really nice if your bag, um, if your bottle, sorry, does have some condensation, this would kind of wick it away and keep it away from everything else in your bag. Uh, the other thing you'll see over here, this is the small Demi Dover Axle lunchbox, and I've just got a few snacks in here. Uh, this is, again, in, in the small size. Uh, I just have a Pro Stack. I've got some uh, cookies and crackers and little uh, mandarins in there, and just some cookies and applesauce and that sort of thing. And this is in the color Pomelo, which is a discontinued color, but I actually think it goes pretty well with the Pinto if you're looking for some items that might match. Uh, further into the bag, you'll see that there is uh, this guy. This is uh, part of a two-piece set. This is the smaller one from the Lug uh, paddle set, and it comes with a wristlet, which you could switch to either the larger one or the smaller one. Again, this is a smaller one. The larger one is pretty big size. Um, I can link them if you're interested in checking them out. Um, and this is a little pouch that has a ton of organization, surprisingly. It's got two big pouch pockets back here. Um, I've got crayons in this one and a little mini puzzle here. Um, I've just got a play pack in the middle, but I usually also have a boogie board and a small notepad in there. And then over here, sorry. Over here, there's a clear view pocket, so you can see exactly what you've got in there, and I've just got some mag formers tucked away in there. Um, and that is the perfect size for holding all of that, and it doesn't take up too much room in my bag. Uh, continuing on in here, there is a big pocket back here. It closes with Velcro. And in here, I have uh, just a bigger activity book and uh, this is the Jujubee Be Quick, and in here I just have a travel potty seat for my daughter in case we do stop somewhere. And this, I had actually tested this out with my 14-inch Lenovo ThinkPad, and it does fit in here really comfortably with room to spare. Uh, the one thing to note is that it's not padded or anything, it's the same canvas material, but if you did want to keep your laptop in there and away from everything else, you could do that. So that's it for this side. Um, one thing I can show you is that this is like one big flap. So if you wanted to have something on the inside of the bag there and just cover it with this, you could, and it would kind of keep it separate from the other items. It would still be accessible from the bottom and would touch other things, but if you had something like a book or something like that, you could kind of tuck it back there. So turning this around, there are two more pockets here, and this is, uh, just one of three pieces of a pouch set. This is the lug transport set, and I just got some medical needs for my daughter in there. In this pocket back here, these are pretty generous pockets. I've got sunscreen, uh, hand sanitizer, and bug spray for my daughter. And those are all in that back pocket here. And there is also a zippered pocket here if you had some things that you wanted to tuck away. And those fit pretty well back there. And this one, just like the other one, I hope you're seeing this, is just a flap that lifts up. So once that's down, um, down at the bottom of the bag, oh, sorry, I did forget this. This bag also comes with a leash, a key leash. And uh, it's different from my other Dagny bags because this is not stretchy. This is in the same cotton canvas material. And I've just got my keys attached at the end in this pouch because I don't really like it when my key fob gets uh, kind of messed with with the other items in my bag. So I just dropped that right in there so it's always easily accessible. And um, that is it, I believe. Um, this is um, like a regular canvas 
on the exterior of the bag, except for the bottom. I think you can see that there's a kind of a sheen, there's some sort of coating here so that if you put it on the ground, um, it won't get dirty and I don't think it would get wet either because it's pretty, yeah, I can't really, well, I can bend it, but it's pretty stiff, it holds its shape and I think this would protect it from getting damaged at all. But overall, although this is not the typical type of bag that I would choose, I have really enjoyed this. Um, it's perfect. Um, oh, in case you were wondering, it doesn't have a zipper closure or anything. It's just a completely open tote at the top. But for these purposes, for taking to the park or an outdoor bag or for the beach, it's a really great bag. Um, and so far, I have enjoyed it. If you do have any questions, please let me know. I'd be happy to answer them in the comments below. Um, if you are interested in a Dagny bag, uh, I will leave a coupon code down at the bottom if you wanted to check that out. And of course, if you do have any questions, please let me know. As always, thank you so much for watching, and if you have not already, please subscribe to my channel, and I hope to see you again soon. Thanks so much. Take care.